And now, here's Betty Furness to talk about the good old days. You probably don't remember, but back in Grandma's day, ladies actually wore costumes like this when they went for a ride in a horseless carriage. And back in those same days, a New York State farmer named Clarence Timmerman started using the actual Westinghouse electric motor you see right here. And now, after 48 years, he still uses this amazing motor to power his feed grinder, saw, hay hoist, and so on. And just think, this year, electricity will be available to 95% of America's farms. That's why, starting August 26th, they'll be celebrating Farm Electrification Week. Of course, this old electric motor made by Westinghouse is amazing, but the new ones are even more so. Here's a brand new Westinghouse Lifeline motor with the same horsepower, but it's a third smaller in size and weight. And isn't it smart looking? The metal in this plant is all steel. And watch this one. Now there's real proof that a steel motor is lots stronger than a cast iron one. Two generations ago, Westinghouse built that motor to last years longer. And now, through the genius of Westinghouse research, they've modernized their motors like this one. The Lifeline motor is another Westinghouse first. All steel, stronger, and lubricated for life. Don't you agree that these two mo motors prove again that you can be sure if it's Westinghouse? 